Brazil's dream of beating its own record of five championships is growing, especially among thousands of children from low-income communities who dream of becoming football stars. Programs that use football for social inclusion, such as the one operated by the legendary player Zico, are on the rise. Lucrecia Franco reports from Rio de Janeiro. It is the mad football nation of some 200 million people. And though they support different local teams with fervor, Brazilian fans will unite. A sixth World Cup championship would be glory, especially for these boys that believe it will increase the world's demand for Brazilian players. They are enrolled in the football program Zico 10, which is headed by former Brazilian football star Artur Antunes Coimbra, nicknamed Zico. The program is a social project that requires more than athletic skills. The differential of this project is that the kids need to be attending school, get good grades, study regularly, and if they don't, we ask them to leave. Zico's project serves some 50,000 children from poor communities in Brazil. But the idea behind it is not to form professional players, but more importantly, valuable citizens. The program uses a natural passion for football to drive away these boys from gangs and drugs, as it demands discipline and commitment as a major rule. We learn to deal with more people. To behave with the elder, we followed the example of Zico to be educated, and that is what we learn what this school teaches us. In addition to free football classes, students get to participate in youth tournaments around the world. Some even have learned to express themselves in English. My biggest dream is soccer player, to be soccer player. But uh, in Brazil, have many, many soccer players, the best world soccer players, and Ronaldinho and Neymar. And my dream is to be soccer player. It may be a dream, but it is also a reality. The majority of players on Brazil's national squad come from poor neighborhoods. But if the students don't succeed, Zico says, they can profit from football. The essence of the game is to socialize, to learn to live in a group. And all these ingredients, even if they don't become soccer players, it will be useful in any other profession. But for now, these kids hope to become future football stars. Lucrecia Franco, CCTV, Rio de Janeiro.